T2B from the Take Back BRC with a message to the world. Yo, man, it all makes sense now. Puff Daddy connected all the dots for a nigga like me. All I got to do is just hear a little bit and I'll discern what's going on in the spirit world. All you got to do is show me a little flash of it and I'll, and I'll, I'll peek beyond the veil. What Puff Daddy is doing, bro, let's start here. Okay, look at Puff Daddy and Jennifer Lopez. Keep that in mind. I'm going to use Puff Daddy and Will Smith for, this, for these two examples. Look at P. Diddy and J-Lo at the start of his career. Hook him up with J-Lo. Hook him up with a woman. Hook him up with Kim Porter. Puff Diddy fucked the game up for niggas like Jay-Z. Even Jay-Z. Hook Jay-Z up with Foxy Brown. Hook Jay-Z up with Beyonce. Put that, even though they're they abusing these bitches, even though they're abusing these beautiful women, put that woman on their arm. Put Jada Pickett on Will Smith's arm. I I used to think like I used to think I used to think yo I always knew like these marriages are staged like you can tell even 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 actors when they when they when these actors marry each other I thought they were just marrying each other to protect their secrets like like they setting up somebody in the industry a man in the industry to marry another woman in the industry so I thought they both were evil and in some cases they are like in Will Smith and Jada Pickett case but it's the same thing. In their case, they put her over Will to handle her because she was more seasoned and Will was a loose cannon. So you can see why they you, you, you can see how and why they matched them up. They matched Puff Daddy up with J Lo because she she J Lo made him a star. That's what made me be like, oh, he official when he married her. Like, oh, and it and it, it took any inclination of thinking he was a monster out of your mind. Remember that. I'm slow, I'm gonna drive you into this. We driving slow today. We on cruise control. But it takes her, him and J Lo took any inclination of him abusing, because that was just they they just they just put a depiction of a man that loves women. That's that that's what they want to do. I thought it I thought they were doing it setting men up with women in the industry because they didn't want men to date women in the real world. And then they tell the women their secrets. But these niggas got friends, these niggas got sisters, they can tell. So it's not that. They matched these Puff Daddy revealed that they matched men up with women in Hollywood to protect the true homosexual nature of that man to protect the true perversion that they got that man doing so all so 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 now we need to look at every every questionable um relationship within hollywood to where somebody in hollywood married another woman in hollywood there's a theory behind that and i'll tell you the theory this 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 t2b theory if you if there's any man that's been in a relationship with a with a woman that's in the industry when you when you be thinking like why why would he do that why wouldn't he go with a woman or when you see all these industry people getting together, um all these Kardashians getting together with different industry men every man they set up with the Kardashians, so it's different elements to it. When they set a man up with a Kardashian, they trying to turn him into a P Diddy. So Kanye was I'm telling y'all some deep shit, boy. I, I I'm learning. I'm God talking to me as I'm talking to y'all. So Kanye, they saw he was gonna be famous, put him under Kim Kardashian. Turn him into a P. Diddy. And she and, and she's the witch that'll turn you into a monster. If it don't work, and if you're too strong, they're gonna separate you from her and they're gonna destroy you. We look at it, we looking at it like the Kardashians, the Kardashian curse, the Kardashian. It ain't no Kardashian curse, it's the industry. Setting the men up with the women. If 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 the men don't allow that that car that Kim Kardashian woman to turn him into a devil, they just get him away from her. It ain't got nothing to do with her. It's the agenda of the higher ups. And this and it's her position as a handler. Turn him into a devil. It ain't she might be a beautiful person, but that's her job in the industry. And, 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 and I'm not gonna say you're a beautiful person once you take on that job because you take on the identity of your position once you take on that job because it's spiritual and that and that job becomes you. Even if even if you went into it thinking, I'm not gonna never let this change who I am. I'm just gonna do it for the money. A lot a, a lot of artists do it for the money because they don't think we care. And they're like, these motherfuckers don't care. I'm gonna do it anyway. Man, these, I'm, I'm going to tell you all some shit later. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bungee jump subject, and I'll get back to this. But the main thing about, man, these artists, see, I ain't want to forget this thing. I ain't want to forget what I was about to say. Mm. So, but that's the gist of it, bro. So when you see them setting these men up with women that's in the industry, or these young women, these young singers, they are, they are doing it for two reasons. Sometimes when they're younger, it's for the man to program the woman. And just to and just to create a channel 
for the for the sorcery to put that woman on the stage like a Beyonce. And, and, and when she and, and when she sings with that demonic spirit that she's telling you she got, she's telling you, like, I'm singing through a demonic spirit. And when you and when you cheering it, you receiving that demonic energy and it's taking your light. It's taking your light and you receiving that darkness. It's turning your light into darkness. Then it's channeling that darkness back into you. It's using you as a vacuum to just circulate demonic energy. They using humans as a vacuum to circulate demonic energy. They they present something as light. Um, Molly Cyrus. They present her as something good. Get all the innocent children to get around her. Then they turn her into darkness. And they get a majority of them to still worship that darkness. And that darkness takes their light, turns it into darkness, gives it back, takes it, gives it back. And it, it's a, it becomes a wheelbarrow. It becomes an energy. It's like a, it's, it's like a manufactured spiritual energy, like a wheelbarrow, like 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 water height, like like hydraulic energy, bro. That's the type of spiritual battle the devil smart, bro. I know that nigga shit. I know all his shit. That's why I innovate the nigga that used to be telling niggas. I, I everything I told y'all came to pass. Every single thing. It, it made me look crazy in the moment. But in the long run, that shit came to fruition, bro. And I don't mean to say no corny word like, like I talk like that, but I study English. I'm a writer. That word came to pass. So um, I, I just said that to put that in y'all spirit and, and for y'all to, to just, just think about that. And, and, if, and if somebody got more time on their hands or somebody got more knowledge of how to research, just, just, just take your time and look at the men, white or black, old or young. Look at the, the, the Hollywood marriages. And then look at that man and you'll see that they didn't they, they put that woman with that man to, to to give that man the image of a of a man that's that's not out here tricking with other men, turning other men out. A man that's not. Be, so it's a science to it. They they put that woman to a man to hide. And it's, and it's hard to say because they so boastful, like we gay, we gay. But at the same time, they'd be like, we, I'm, I'm proud of white. But at the same time, they hide who they are. You know what I mean? So it's, it's we dealing with we dealing with a subconscious that operates outside of their consciousness. They operating in the subconscious and they're not even conscious of it. That's crazy. Innovate out.